Hey, orange one here. So it's probably going to get pretty loud in just a second as soon as we move. So uh, yeah, we're going to fight this group and we'll see how that goes. Um, but, but, but I've got my gun out actually already. I could just take shots at some of them. Oh, they're going after the cattle dog. Oh yeah, there's the prototype uh, thing. Do I want my friend to come out? We'll let him get close and then I'll... Where is he? Is he just staying in there? No, he's coming out. Okay. Can I just inspect his wounds? He's, he's kind of hurt. Maybe I'll, I'll I'll keep you in there, bud. Yeah. You can stay in there. It's fine. And then these things, I'm going to just see if they can kill the prototype. Or did they kill it already? Yeah, I don't see, I don't see the prototype. There's the EMP grenades, blah blah blah. There's the, there's the robot, it's down there. Okay, um, they're gonna start making their way towards me then. I'm gonna just start thinning them up. That hunter killer is actually tougher than I thought it was. Oh, okay. Let's see if we can kind of keep the dog alive so that they target the dog and not me. Yeah, that's actually working really nicely because now they're kind of going. Oh no, whoops, wrong one. You know, it's just a, what is that, a Hulk? I'm going to actually, because we're going to get go deaf anyways from all the shooting that I'm doing here. Black Ops Zombie, is that one that has EVMs in it. I think it is. I'm not 100% sure about that, but I'm pretty sure. Um, can I reload this? Um, out of the leg pouch, please. Oh, it's actually the same speed as out of the suit. Interesting. Kind of weird. I mean... Maybe I shouldn't have those things on my legs then. Maybe I should just keep them in my suit. Okay, it's it's pretty much dead. Okay, it's gonna smack me real soon. I'm gonna just see if I can run fast enough away from it and have it bleed out. There's a couple of them right there. Can I outrun it? It's uh, it is bleeding, but I can't really read all of it, unfortunately. Can I, like, if I try and look at it, then, no, okay, whatever. I'm just gonna shoot, uh, auto. Oh my gosh. Man, really? You're still alive. Okay, we're gonna go semi-auto. And he's going to smack me any second now. Whatever. I think I'm in pain right now. Yeah, this thing's going to go down pretty soon. There we go. I went down. Is the laser rifle, is it more effective against the Hulks? I'm, I'm just curious. I don't think it is, but it might be. What were those Hulks chasing? Um, caustic, and then we got those folks there. Just gonna go in here for a second. You know, we can uh, look out the front now. I don't know if you, I showed that off, but check this out. Uh, we got, hold on, we've got a camera in the front. I, I think I put it um right there. Yeah. And this is actually still busted up. I need to get that fixed up. I keep on forgetting to do that. Um, but we've got fully reloaded. We're all like kitted out pretty nicely. This backpack that we're wearing doesn't have anything in it. So maybe I could just drop that. Um, hold on. Where has space there? Okay. Drop the backpack there, and I'm actually going to see if I can 
bit more um because we got this can go into a survivor harness is that what i have i have a survivor suit so can i open that and look at what's in there yeah i've got two ma magazines already in there that's kind of crazy that um the moves to get out of the suit is the same as the lego leg <laughs> lego that that other thing so if that's the case i'm just going to keep my ammo in here then insert those yep oh you can't put them in there okay you could put most of them i think i've just got too much stuff in there can i open it then what do we have in here they've got a ton of stuff that we don't really need in here yeah we can we can make some space we can totally make space for this um what did I have on me that I had like some junk on me, I think, actually. Like, I don't know about that data card. Wasn't there some junk? No, maybe not. Okay, let's just go ahead and put I don't think I need those anymore. Um don't really need that. Yeah, we'll keep that on us and that too. And then let's see. I think we should keep the Prussian blues on us. Refillable, we'll put away, seeing how we got the other one. We don't really need the survival marker. I mean, the towel is moderately useful, but if I don't need it, then I'm going to put it away. How much space do I have? I've still got a fair amount of space. There. Let's go ahead and put that away at least. And then can I try and insert the other yes wait hold on into the port of body wait hold on no is that correct no okay that's that was a different message okay cool so i think that i can then put my other leg out there and that should help me and i think i'm also going to take those out so we can actually hear and go out this way you know what, actually, bud, you can come out, because you're actually good against the zombie hulks. Just gotta make sure that caustic one doesn't get you. Don't worry, I got my gun. Okay, um, and there's this hunter-killer zombie. I'm curious about the black um, ops zombie. Southwest. If I read that, is it going to be like, oh, hey, like, more items here. Um, let's see. I'm going to just tell my my buddy there to not take out the corpses, and I'm going to do them myself. Uh, miscellaneous rules. Leave corpses alone for now, please. Thank you. Um, and I will take out these, um, hunter-killer ones, I think. Because I don't think the hunter-killers are anything special. Are they? Yeah, no, that's, that's some weird, like, space, spatial zombie magic. Um... I think we might want to just make sure these guys don't get up for now. I don't want to do the Black Ops bit. What about the other corpses? Yeah, I think I ignore and let them come towards me. The Hunter one, I will try and actually just shoot because they've basically seen us now. We gotta fight them. But we got this. I'm not gonna go for the skeletal one, but okay, earplugs back in. We can definitely take out these these hulks. Or really hurt them at least. There is a lot of them. So I'm gonna need to go automatic on these guys. Almost certainly using my 
adrenal CVM as well. But I think we got this. I mean, given the fact that they're not going to slow me down with pain, really, I'm pretty confident. Okay, that guy's pretty hurt. Though there's one that's closer to us that I think we should probably be aiming at. There is an awful lot of them, though. That is a little bit concerning. Okay, let's go ahead and get that adrenal pump going and joint servo. Yeah. Oh, actually, we probably don't need that on right now. Okay, um, yeah, this guy, I think we need to start autoing on, on them. Um, reload. Now we just gotta reload it. And let's actually see if I can get a good auto on him. I think I can. Yeah, auto. Do I have any grenades or anything? I do not. I should have probably grabbed a grenade. I mean, it's not too late. Okay, now this thing's gonna probably bleed out soonish. But you really. We gotta fight them. And. This guy's gonna go down pretty soon. Okay, I'm. I just use a whole lot of ammo there. But they'll go down in like any second from the bleeding, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, he's he's saying like let's get out of here. I knew probably could, to be honest. But I don't think we need to. I might regret that. Um hold on. Yep, get that out. Oh, there's actually a couple of the little ones coming too now. Uh, let's try and clear out this guy in the front. Okay, uh, yeah, there's quite a few hunter killers behind him now. Okay, that one's down. And how am I doing? I got 14 rounds left. Okay, uh, I think we killed one of them, maybe? I'm not sure. Okay, Harvey, you really... really are not living up to my expectations right now. I wish that they would stand their ground a little bit more. Maybe if... can I... talk to him? Be like, yo... Um, engagement rules. Uh, let's see. Let's go with F. Attack anything that you want. If you if you want, I'm saying come back here. Just you know, if you want. Okay, let's see. Yeah, the hunter killer is pretty much dead. Let's see if I can get this one. Okay, that now that's out of ammo. Okay, um, we got two more. Ah man, Harvey. I really, if Harvey would stand with us, we could really take out these guys. And I just because I think the other ones are gonna bleed out soon. He's got heavy bleeding. Okay, he went down. Okay, these these hulks are they're getting hurt. But I I don't think that. Let's see if I can get to my friend or not. Because if I can get to him and kind of like push him. I think we can take these guys out, but I don't know what he's running into, to be honest. So I might want to loop to the car. Some chickens. And I 
some wreckage. Okay, well, I hope that I can catch him. I think I can. It's going to be actually kind of close, to be honest. He's like really gunning it. Oh man. Retreat, retreat. I wish I could tell him to like stand his ground. Yeah, don't retreat, man. Guard here. I do not want you retreating. We got this. There we go. That one's down. Um, and now I'm out. Last last clip. Okay. I don't know why it's aiming at them. Um, let's go semi-auto. This one's pretty much dead. I gotta basically make a stand here. My companion runs and he runs. Okay, one of them is down. I have to just get kind of smashed by these guys. It's not her. I'll do what I can first. At least I've gotten some of my breath back. Yeah, nice. This one's almost dead. Okay, gun is out of ammo. Um, how are we doing? Adrenaline rush is still active. We gotta get the Jane out. Uh, can I wheel Jane? Just drop it, it's fine. Uh, my friend is still running away. Okay, let's try and get somewhere that I can at least not get completely out of breath. That also should be loose. That would, would actually helped with us quite a bit earlier, but whatever. How are we doing? Okay, that one's pretty much dead. I think I can kill the other one. But out of breath, I'm not sure. But I do have pretty low encumbrance right now, which is good. Definitely good. Okay, I'm trying to stand. Okay, we're standing. That's nice. I have to kind of just do this though, unfortunately. They're bleeding and they're gonna hurt me. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be brutal. Um, that one is pretty much dead. Uh, can I not be in melee against two of them at the same time? <laughs> okay, that scabbard's gonna get bust it up. I kind of want to drop it. Get the repair one going. Um, we got that adrenaline rush going. Anything else I could use? I do have, if I do get an adrenaline come down, yeah, he's still saying book it. He's such a coward, man. Got this. I think. I hope. I don't think I have much of an option, seeing how we abandoned the car. We'll see how uh, fast I heal up from that arm injury. That's pretty bad, actually. Okay. Um, I think I can kill this one. The question is, once I've killed the one, am I going to be able to get away from the other? Which is probably not. of the adrenaline actually right now so we're not getting that pleasure from that that we would normally would okay, this thing has to be just about dead there we go one of them is dead friend I would really like it if you can I walk over to you now are you 
gonna stand the ground with this maybe yeah okay cool now we can actually do something you know what buddy you can you can take the front force of this where's the hulk oh man i would like to get to the hulk Juggernaut seems to be getting royally messed up. I'm too exhausted. Do I have my... No. Okay, I can at least distract this guy. Which is good, right? That's good for Harvey. While he's actually killing one. He's like... He's really underestimating his ability, you know? Okay, the Skeletal Juggernaut is pretty much dead. again. Um, can I get that in there? Cool. Ooh, man. Boy, howdy. That was quite the combat. I didn't expect that to go into a whole episode. How are we doing wound-wise with you, Harvey? Ooh. Ouch. Yeah, you're actually super messed up. I should probably ended you up a little bit. Well, at least for me, my radiation will go down because radiogenic will essentially uh, use itself um, on my radiation and lower it. So yay for that. Actually, considering that, let's turn off the repair nanobots and just kind of go all natural as much as we can. How's his gear doing? Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay, did I destroy those corpses? Yes, we did. Okay, let's keep on making our way back. Our arm is not good. Um, actually, RV, come with me. Let's go. I, I forgot that he was on that guard thing. He's suffering from radiation sickness. Me too, my friend. Yeah, I'm pretty much the same as what we were. I think if we stay on the move, we're okay. Am I on the blue? I am not on the blue. Let's take another Prussian blue. It should lower my dosage. Can I Geiger counter him as well? It's about the same. Can I tell him to use one? There's something I want you to do. See, I want you to use a Prussian blue. Cool. Okay, so he should have lower radiation because of that. That should have an effect on him, right? Well, as metal, metal wreckage, I could have probably ran them a little bit more into that if I was smarter. Okay, yep. 
I do like the bleeding effect though. Done really nicely. Um, okay, nothing there. Where's my gun? There it is. Do I have all my magazines? I do have all my magazines on me. Cool. Alright, let's get that on. Man. What an epic fight. That was actually kind of fun. See, this is what the game's all about, right? Okay, we do have some meals here. I don't think I can eat these because they're not just meat, but... Yeah, actually, I could. Cool. Actually, it's I can eat beans. Okay. This is bean flesh junk food. So I can have junk food and beans. Awesome. That's good to know. I'm also going to open these up then. Can I eat that stuff? No, I can't. If it's just that uh, junk food, then I can't have it. But Okay, I can have junk food dairy. Interesting. Well, why don't we have these things? Because they're actually like decent meals as opposed to what we've got for us. Um, and then we'll have some cracklings as well just to kind of fill up. Okay, we're satisfied. Yum. A disgusting meal. I just like ate fat basically. But I have a carnivore like mutant thing that like essentially turns their radiation into health. Like a ghoul. <laughs> right? So I'm joyful. That's nice. So I got a little bit more speed. Um, my current speed is not the fastest though. And it's okay. But my intelligence definitely is hurt. My dexterity isn't really that bad. My strength is definitely hurt a little bit though. Hey bud, you wanna um, take that out for me? Thank you. What is that? Okay, yeah, that's nothing. Do I have... I thought I had like some junk items in here. Yeah, what's with this spare battery here? Because I, I don't see that here. Is it? Oh, it's in here. I see. Can I unload that? I just dropped that. That's that's a junk item. That's kind of nice seeing that. But now I, I need to get a new thing for my flashlight, I think. And we can just follow this blood trail. Right? Uh, caustic. That's annoying. Can I get behind the car. Okay, yeah, I don't think they've seen us. We're good. We're fine. Let's get into the car for a little bit. But why don't you heal up? I'm gonna maybe disinfect him. Because I probably have... Yeah, I've got multiple antiseptics around, and I think I've got multiple first aid kits as well. So let's just uh, let's get a little, a little care. He needs it. He really does. At least on those limbs. The other limbs, maybe I'll, I'll take care of those another time. But for now, let's see. Oh, look, another two-way radio. I'll take that because, um, yeah, I like that for role purposes, role-playing purposes. Oh, cool. We got more, more meals. I can't pick them up though. Too full. I guess it's like all the antiseptic and whatnot that I'm carrying. Fine, I've got my gun. I can do what I need to do. Just gonna take care of these guys. Man, it feels good, like, after a battle like that, where it's like, it actually was kind of close. Oh my gosh, three grenades. Oh man, I could have just grabbed those. What's this? Oh, look at that. Let's, uh, let's check this out. Let's see what's in this. Tourniquet, okay, adhesive bandage, bandages, cool, I'll take those. And I think that's gonna be really good for bleeding, stopping bleeding, so we could just pour that on a wound. That's awesome. 
So we should really do that. This is good for bleeding. This is really much better for bl stopping bleeding, so hemostatic powder. Can, if you give NPCs that stuff, will they actually use it? Like, this is, yeah, like a terrible item. This is actually pretty good for bleeding as well, medical gauze. I think we'll keep the hemostatic powder on us. I think that's actually what you would use in, in a situation like that. If I wanted to... Yeah, I don't think that the hunter ones are actually TBM ones, but I could be wrong. There's more grenades here. Yeah, these guys actually have some pretty decent gear on them. Cool. Uh, I will take that, because that's the quest item that we, we came here for. <laughs> if, by the way, you forgot what this whole episode was about. Uh, Black Ops Zombie. I'm pretty sure this one is a special one. To get the gun out and reload it. I actually don't have all of my things fully loaded. Maybe I should do that before I... Try and dissect this guy. Um, can I reload? Just yeah, just ignore. Just reload. You're fine. I'll just you know get my distance over here. Hello. Do I need to go auto on you? I don't. Awesome. That was easy enough, right? Yeah, I don't, I don't care if it's acidic. Ignore. Just get a little acid on your feet, get a little more, more pain. My arms gotta heal anyways. It's not like the pain affects me. Um, and then there was... What is this right here? The EMP grenades. Nice. Okay, cool. And... I'm gonna see if we can dissect this guy without getting disturbed. I think we probably will. Um, yes. Okay, we did get disturbed. I thought so. Okay, I'm gonna end this here. Thank you for joining me. This has been Orange One.